Thank you for returning to CoinSeris channel. First things first, before we dive into today's XRP conversation, I need your help deciding what other subjects to cover. Let us know what you think in the designated area. I want to focus today on XRP because I think it's safe to say that everyone is thinking about it. The most noteworthy part was that Brad Garland's residence, where he would provide his market opinion, was still pending settlement. Both Brad's public statements about the impending launch of an XRP ETF and our familiarity with the concept are known to us. It paves the way for several things, including an altcoin option. Who can say for sure, but it's well recognized that the settlement could be the catalyst for XRP's meteoric rise. Maybe we'll even try our hand at meme currency exchange traded funds. What transpires when an XRP ETF materializes Brad Garland House and Larry Fink have brought it up, so let's just talk about it briefly. Too far, there has been no Ethereum exchange traded fund ETF despite the ebb and flow of Bitcoin ETFs. Thus, we are aware that the cryptocurrency was the subject of great interest and expectation prior to the introduction of the Bitcoin ETF. Life is like this, you know. Clearly, the Ethereum one's final fate remains a mystery. I think XRP, on the other hand, would be pretty comparable. Speculation of an XRP ETF started about six months ago, and since then, market activity has been skyrocketing. However, at 51 cents per coin, XRP isn't exactly a bargain for institutions looking to purchase an ETF. A huge upswing reached 78 cents in an instant before turning around. It is obvious that food is scarce. One more thing I'd want. Aside from that, I think it's crucial that Brad has made his feelings about the current state of XRP ETFs known in a straightforward and simple way, otherwise, everyone would be arguing over meaningless numbers, especially because of XRP. Both its value and its cost are unaffected. So far, that's about all the talk about this. I anticipate that my interest will be piqued when it occurs. It doesn't matter if it's less than 10 million or more than 1 billion, what matters is that we resolve it promptly. We had a hunch the SEC was in trouble, but this confirms it. On top of that, we were hoping Joe Biden wouldn't reject size 121. How it plays out is up to us to determine. However, there is a portion reserved for the future. When it comes to XRP, create 51. Furthermore, one should arrive to you today, most likely in the morning. That settlement will soon be a thing of the past for us. After that, you might be wondering, just what is an exchange traded fund, anyway how can organizations find fulfillment between the two numbers am I correct in assuming that 345 plus 10 will equal the total tell me when XRP will be brought up. Would you like a more specific inquiry in other words, some people might press 1000 while others press 10,000. My head is spinning. In the near run, though, I'd wager one. Hey, guess what the outcome will be determined by the passage of time. After ETF potential, I'm hoping for something a bit higher. Whatever happens, we will just have to wait patiently. In regards to XRP, I remain quite optimistic. As far as I'm concerned, this is quite newsworthy. In addition, I believe there are times when it could be better to be quiet and not share any news. Lots of things are happening behind the scenes, and they frequently pop up when you least anticipate them. My current role has also provided me with the expertise I need to back it up. Without a doubt, 100%. Although the settlement could take place this week, I believe that all parties involved would do well to focus on XRP consolidation in the lead up to the ETF frenzy. The answer is unclear to me. The video is now ended. 
your support in the form of a channel subscription would be greatly appreciated. On my way soon, farewell.